Hello everyone. Welcome back to my YouTube channel. We are playing some more Starfield on PC. I did everything I could to try to get more frames and unfortunately I am not able to. It is not my driver. I updated it to the newest version and I have that and I am still stuck at 30 frames. I think it's um the game. <clears throat> Unfortunately, I did read that they have a deal with AMD, so they more than likely prioritized AMD drivers more, and that's why everyone with NVIDIA drivers, even with the 4090s, are even getting 30 frames. I've been reading on Steam forums that they're even getting 30 frames a second which is pretty sad but it's it is what it is i can't fix it on my end i've done all i can so but the game is still playable regardless i mean it's a beautiful world the graphics are wonderful so far no bugs the frame rate is the only issue that i have same for everyone else They'll fix it eventually. So, oh no, I want to save. I want to save. I want to do a quick save, but I don't want to. Alright. And I'm still trying to learn how this stuff works. I'm not a fan of this mechanic, but I will get used to it. And once I get used to it, then I will enjoy it more. So this one... Okay, they can go there or there. Or there. <coughs> Alright. They can go there or here. Or here. I'm gonna put it there. Okay, that one can go there. <clears throat> and this one. Can go where? <clears throat> okay, so I think this one has to go out here somewhere. No, it is not. It goes on the inner ring. No, the out. Oh, it goes here. So this one has to go here. Then this one has to go in the inside. So this is this one. Nope, I think it's fudged. I think I screwed the pooch. Nope, this one goes here. Okay. Okay, there we go. I got it. <clears throat> awesome. I'm learning how it works. What's up, kitty? What's he doing, little buddy, huh? What's he doing? What's all this stuff? Two go cups, huh? I could read all this stuff, but oh, did it actually add it to my inventory? I guess it did. I could read all of this stuff, but it's my first playthrough. But what I'll do is I'll leave it up there long enough for you guys to pause it. And yeah. That's what I'll do. So if you guys want to read it, go ahead. I don't mind. 
but it's my first time playing a game. Reading all the lore, I mean, I guess I could, but I don't know. Um, it's stolen, so yeah, I guess I will because it is it is stolen. So let me. Uh, I'm also dirty. Good lord. All right. <clears throat> and yet, despite its reputation as a Sido System's premier pleasure city, Neon is also a also home to a plethora of criminals, ruffians, and assorted dregs. Some of these. Malcontents merely walk the streets alone, preying on lost tourists who have strayed too far from the beaten path. But the worst offenders are organized groups. Hold on, there's something else on my eyeballs here. I need to get rid of it so I can see. It's like right in my line of vision. And it's annoying as heck. Those who have banded together for a common criminal cause. The worst offender is, of course, the Siak Ghoul Syndicate. I might have mispronounced that. I'm sorry if I did. A crime syndicate bold enough to publicly flaunt their name and rumored to be affiliated with or even directly controlled by Neon Mayor Benjamin Bayou. And then, of course, there are the smaller yet no less dangerous street gangs. The Epsite Strikers and the Disciples. As with most gangs, their members pride themselves on being family, but the only blood they're interested in <coughs> is what they can spill in the streets. And this is a examination of the gang culture in depth. Okay. He did not have any cooperation of those he wrote about. Cool. All right, I'm going to drop that here because it is stolen. I don't want to mess with the ste with stealing stuff right now because it is illegal and apparently. It's a different kind of illegal, which I approve of. And I do want to go into that later on, but not right now. Unauthorized computer. Ooh. Creative with wiring. So the money's digital. ATM trans fee. Total value. Can we take all that money and run? That'd be wonderful. Because I know they sell you soup in the future. Oh my. Ugh. No eyelashes. You're not going to do that crap today. I don't want you to do this to me. Not right now. Please. I'm playing a video game. Stop it. Washers and dryers. Fancy. Gas stoves. I'm glad I went back to gas stoves in the future. We're still with electric stoves. If the power goes out, we can't cook food. All these drawers and we can't open them up. Pretty sad. I want to open all these things, Todd. Please. Please, Todd. Please. I want to search all these things and open them up. Okay, there has to be like a, um... Like a safe or something in here somewhere. 
You would think there'd be a safe somewhere. But maybe there's not a safe. It isn't. I, I don't know. You never know. I guess not. I mean, for a one bedroom, this is pretty spacious. It's actually bigger than what I have now. Actually, no. This is bigger than what I have now. Way bigger. This is about the same size. But that right there is bigger. I don't have this though. Yeah, maybe it is bigger. Yeah, no, it is. Damn. I'm jealous. What's the rent? <laughs> I'll freaking live here. I don't mind. Oh, can I go in here? Oh, wrong one. Dude, you're in the way. Come on now. Alright, now we got some chubby frames, but I can't help it because, you know, it's not my fault, it's the game. I did all I could. Max graphics, lower graphics, same frame rate, I can't help it. The game is still playable though. Regardless, I mean, whatever. <clears throat> if we only have to deal with the frame rate issues in this city, so be it. I don't care. It is what it is. You have a nice day now. Oh, well, thank you. And I also messed with the um, crowd density settings. That does sh nothing. It does not do anything for the frame rate or the density of people at all. It, it doesn't do nothing. Even after a full reboot of the game, and I mean closing the game out and booting it back up, it, it no, nothing. Not a darn thing. Need to get down there. I forgot how to get down there though. Dang it. Oh, here it is. Duh. I wish I had a map, but I don't have a map. The only map I have sucks, but it's fine. Whatever. Activate. Oh, my kitty sleeping. Just a good little boy. Now we're back in the slums where everyone lives, I guess. I don't know. Where everyone of um, certain ethnic colors and all that stuff live. Which is, I guess, fine. I don't know. Oh, there's that butthole Mess again. With me and I'll serve you my famous knuckle sandwich. <laughs> Scared, aren't you? No. You won't find anything at Enrix. The places where good selection goes to die. I got a shotgun and shoot slugs. I ain't afraid of Thanks nothing. Thanks for all that work. You can give me what you found now. Okay, I want to do this because I have two options here. Um, let's give her so the stuff. Down. You've got something to show for it? Great. I'll get this back to mass for analysis. I'm not stupid. I know Zoe probably made you an offer. I appreciate that you didn't take it. And I'm really glad we got to work together on this. Okay, so this... Okay, so 2,000 credits and 75 XP. Let's see what Zoe gives us. I'm curious. If it's the same amount, whatever. You're going to hand over what you've discovered, yes? 
Do you have something for me? I'm glad you made the right decision. I'll look this over and make sure that Mast gets just as much as they need, not a bit more. The Trade Authority will not forget what you've done for us. Okay. Um. Hey, someone was attempting to hack Galbang? And at a glance, it appears they may have had some success. Mm, this will make for... So it's the same amount no matter what. <clears throat> okay, well, I want to go with her because, yes. So you tracked it down. Great. I'll get... I'm not stupid. And I'm really glad we got the... Level four. All right, 425 XP. Nice. So, looks like maybe someone thought they could hack into Galibank's system. In fact, looks like maybe they did. Still want to claim you had nothing to do with this, Zoe? My dear, why in the world would I want to break the law? And Galbank, no less. I do quite enough business with them as it is. All right. Well, I'll have some people look over this. Maybe they'll be in touch. I very much doubt that. See you around. The Trade Authority has access to goods and services no one else does. No one. Welcome to the Trade Authority. If you're here on legitimate business, I would be more than happy to help you. If, however, you are here under false pretense, say, sent by one Miss Tsang of UC Distribution, then I'm afraid you'll find nothing illegitimate here to report to her. And I'd ask that you pass along my request to stop these silly games. So, what'll it be? Nah, <laughs> curses you blow my cover. You, need anything else? <laughs> you know where to find us. I want to take a look around your room because I can and I want to. Because I'm a douche, I want to, you know, look around if I can. Okay, again here, like, this is an obvious part where we can open stuff up at. Why can't we, I wonder? Is it a perk that we have to have, I wonder? Or is it just like a decision not to allow it? Okay, hello. Yes, what? You're just a random citizen. Okay. Well, on to the next quest. I guess that symbol means show all targets. Okay, so that means completed. Ah! Oh, that's convenient. Activities. <clears throat> oh, I can talk to him now. Why, wonderful. Wrong way. I gotta go this way. Duh. Hold up now. There you go. Have fun with that one. I see you. Is there a fast? Oh my god, there is. What did I just do? I did not mean to do that. That's not my selected... That's not... That was not my selected... Why? 
Why did it do that for? Is there not a way? Okay. Why is it automatically saying this? Why is it automatically asking me if I want to fast travel to my... That's a bug. It should not ask me that right away. All I'm doing is opening up the, the map here. <clears throat> oh, and it's just a, okay, I see now. It won't actually, t uh, uh, okay, well, okay, whoops, now I know why. Never mind, I guess it's not a bug. No, I won't. Bye. Oh, he's wearing a hat. They should have called this Tin Ford. Hope life is treating you well. Let me know if I can get you anything. Hey there. Always nice to see a new face. First time in New Atlantis? <laughs> oh boy. I didn't mean for you to take it personally. It's just something to say to customers. Break the ice. Know what I mean? Listen, you just relax. Make yourself comfortable. You're welcome to stay as long as you want. That work for you, new guy? Let me know if there's anything I can get you. Uh. Yep. Spaceport traffic keeps me pretty busy. But just between you and me, I've got something in the works that'll change everything. A new drink that'll make this place famous. Galaxy-wide. You would love it, I guarantee. Only... I can't make you one right now. Don't have the ingredients. I made a deal with the hauler to bring me some small samples of an ingredient I think will make all the difference. But it never showed up. Turns out the guy I hired was also hired by a few other folks. The kind of folks who ship less than legal cargo. Security got wind, and the whole lot was impounded. Now they're just sitting on it, taking their sweet time like they always do. It's killing me. I submitted all the paperwork, believe me. It won't amount to anything, but I did it. And really, I'm not even certain this is what I need to finish the recipe. I just... I think it is. I need to get my hands on that cargo. Mm. I really do. It's gonna keep me awake nights if I don't try. Before we say anything else, I am in no way asking you to do anything that might violate any of the many, many laws in place here <coughs> in New Atlantis or the larger United Colonies. This is just one friend talking to another friend, asking if maybe that friend could possibly find a way to get her important cargo out of the impound. And if, hypothetically, that were done in a less than 100% legal way, well, that might not be the worst thing in the world. You, uh, with me on this? God, you have no idea what a relief this is. I'm obviously not expecting you or anyone to go in guns blazing and taking hostages or something. I just figure there has to be a way to get what I need. Hmm. 
<laughs> there goes my idea. <laughs> like I said, I submitted the usual security release forms. But because my cargo is tied up with a bunch of, again, totally unrelated illegal stuff, I don't expect the forms to matter. At all. I went and talked to an officer at the office, too. You, me. Sergeant, maybe? He was polite, but unhelpful. I declined to suggest that as our new slogan. New Atlanta security. Polite, but unhelpful. Truth in advertising, eh? I'm not worried. <coughs> I'm annoyed. Wait, are you saying I should be worried? No, of course not. It'll be fine. Totally fine. I, I trust you. Hmm. See you around. All right, so we know Yumi. Yes. Okay. Hello. <coughs> We can maybe use that in with Yumi, even though it's not telling us to. We can maybe go talk to Yumi and yeah. Doctor Roy said, "What's investigation going? Find our pup." Yeah, we all got friends who need things, but we've also got rules and regulations, and I'm not going to bend. Them. Your friend can file a request like everyone else. All right. Let me know if you have any questions. Works for me. I hope was the. Oh, that's right. Um. So that didn't work. I figured. I figured it wouldn't. Anyway, that's why I still tried it because you never know. Do 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 do. Do 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 do. Doink. Thank God for no fall damage right there because yes. All right, so where are we going? Going back here, huh? I got no feet. Hey, this really isn't a good place for civilians to be hanging around. There's something I, I can see help you him with. There. Yeah, I can't really just let you in there. To persuade a person, you need to make successful choices. Choices can range from kind words to distractions to threats. <clears throat> Each choice has a difficulty. The higher the difficulty, the greater chance the choice fails, but the more points you'll earn when you succeed. You have a limited number of choices you can make, but you can never fail if your last choice succeeded. Oh, so this is what it is. This is where that comes in play. Oh, no, you can't save in this. They got rid of that. Oh, no. Those dirty developers. Finally, someone who gets it. Oh, that's a five. This isn't getting us anywhere. Look, I'd like to help, but... All right, look, don't tell anyone I did this for you. I could lose my job over it. I love this new mechanic. Yes, I had nothing to do with it. I love that new mechanic. Oh, man. 
Oh One yes. Second. All right, make it quick, will you? I love that new mechanic. I love it. Oh man, it is so cool. Oh. Oh, he's, he's right there. Oh, and if I do it, it's illegal. Hey, try and be careful, okay? Don't want a ship landing on your head. He's looking away. He's looking away. He's looking away. Oh no! Oh, he's gone now. <coughs> oh crap on a cracker. <sighs> Alright, we're good. I saved, so we're good. Alright, so this one can go in two spots. Okay. see here <clears throat> okay so that one has to go here then that means that this one has to go somewhere on yep okay that one oh no did I screw it up I think I did I think I fudged it yes I did I fudged it I screwed the pooch. Oh, is he still moving? Is he still moving out there? He is still moving. Oh. <clears throat> That's cool. <clears throat> uh, let's see here. Yeah, he's still moving very slowly. That's cool. I like that. Okay, so this one has to go here, I believe. That one can go there. Yes. Or there. I want to say here. Making sure I got them all. Let's see. Yes, yes, and yes. All right. Yep, got them all. Oh, and that was to open that door. 
That was to open that door, that's all that was. Uh... <coughs> now we know. It was to open that door. Now we know. Talk to this person again. <coughs> oh yeah, what do you have back here? Nothing. Cool. Desperate, yeah, I found it. Hey there, new guy. Good to see you again. Can I get you something? I have a present oh, for no you. No way. You really got it? I probably don't want to know what you did to get this, right? I mean, I want to know, but it's maybe better if I don't. Don't worry, I no one died. I hope not. This is a huge deal to me, but it's not worth either of us murdering over. Well, look, I can assure this will all be worth it in the end. Matter of fact, I'm going to let you have the first ever sample. On top of that, you get free drinks. Not, not like unlimited free drinks. But you want a little pick-me-up now and then? I got you covered. I need some time to work on what comes next. But this, this was the difficult part, I think. Really, thank you so much. Supernova added. You know, I had a guy in here last week ranting that General Shao ought to send the Marines down into the well. I'm usually all for letting folks speak their mind. Most times it can't be helped after a few drinks. But that was just too much. Anybody stuck living in the well, it almost certainly isn't by choice. The things down there aren't that bad. You know, I had a guy in here last week. I'm usually all for anybody stuck living in the it's the same line over and Stop over again. By anytime you'd like to catch it. If you have a bounty, don't worry. For a small convenience fee, we can clear it up. Destroy. Kill the spacer punk. Deliver micro motors. Dude, I love this. <coughs> Alright, so what is our. Actually, now what is that drink I got? What does it do for me? 12%. Persuasion chance. Minus. Nope. Minus O2. No, thank you. No, thank you. We're not doing that one.
All right, speak to the scientist again. Oh yeah, we have a skill point. Hold up, I'm curious now. We have a skill point. <coughs> it's too difficult. Okay. So let's do this. And then let's get under it's under tech security pick five locks okay oh man okay damn Wow. Okay, game. You are fun, aren't you? This will take a while to get used to. I don't know if I like this or not. Okay, so this one has to go here. Actually, I don't think you use all of these, do you? Oh, I don't think you use all of them. There's not enough holes. Oh, is that what it is? I don't think you... No, you don't use all of them, do you? Yeah, no, there's not enough slots. There's not enough slots. Or is there? Okay, this is going to be confusing, but let's try to slot the ones we know. So this one, not this one, this one. Yeah, I don't think you use all of them. I really don't think you do. There's no way you do. So it's not that one. It's one of these ones then. go here or there okay it's not that one Is this one? It's not this one. I think I screwed up already. Um. Yes, I did, I think. Yeah, I did. I used the wrong one somewhere. 
Yeah, I didn't want auto slot at all. Load the game. <coughs> it's too difficult. Okay. Security. Yes. All right. I will go ahead and do this and then I do want to see what we get from this. So what does auto slot? Oh, and it tells you where it goes. Okay. It tells you where one goes. It gives you a clue of where one goes. That one obviously goes there. Yes, yeah, so you you definitely do not use all of them. That yeah, no. Okay. There's just more choices to choose from. Yeah, no. This one I don't think you use at all. No. You don't use that one at all. Nor, nor this one. I think the only one you use is these ones. No, it's not this one. Yeah, no, it's none of those ones. Okay, so I think this one goes here. That one goes there. Okay, so then this one goes here. Okay, I think I have it now. Wait, what? No, so I have to use one of these ones then, but I can't because none of them fit. That one was also a dud. None of, none of those fit. None of them fit. I don't like this shit at all, dude. I hate this crap. Can we just get like old school lockpicks, please? Because they're easier. Please. Old school lockpicks will be a lot easier than this crap. Okay, so that one has to go there. It cannot go anywhere else. This one has to go here. It cannot go anywhere else. This one is not used.
Um, this one is. Dude, I don't know on this crap at all, dude. Okay, so I know this one. Okay, there's that one down. Thank goodness, okay. This one has to go here, and then this one has to go. No. It's not this one, it's this one right here, I think. It's not this one either. Nope. So it's this one. Oh my God. A bounty was added to me. Yeah, that's not worth it at all, I'm sorry. Okay, yeah, so those ones are a bit harder to do. Oh, man. And then a bounty was added. Okay. You've come a long way as a species. Oh, I hate those so much. Oh, my God, dude. Isn't this a pleasant surprise? I hadn't expected to run into you again. Yes, well, I had good reason to be distressed. You had already helped me establish that there is something unprecedented going on with this tree. Now my superiors have been made aware. There is growing concern. Oh my, a bit of an unintentional pun, isn't that? Well concern that things are going to get worse. The data we gathered points to a definitive trend. The vibrations coming from this tree are increasing in strength and frequency. Because we've never seen this before, hmm. not on this scale, we have absolutely no idea what the upper limit is. We don't know when or even if this will stop. It's imperceptible by normal human standards now, but given time, while I hesitate to speculate on the possibilities, well, none of them are good. Oh, no. Yes, and not just humans. All organic life will be affected. Low-frequency vibrations are not uncommon in this species. The vibrations help disperse nutrients throughout the tree, However, normally, the vibrations are imperceptible. If the vibrations continue to increase in frequency and strength, prolonged exposure could lead to 
harmful and potentially deadly side effects. It's imperative we find a way to correct this. Hmm. There is data regarding other, younger members of the species. Unfortunately, there are some, shall we say, personal issues with acquiring it. <clears throat> per per personnel issues, if you understand me. What? No, that is ridiculous. I am a professional. One of the other researchers in MAST, Emilio Hadek, has research I believe could be vital to my work here. He and I don't see eye to eye, and so far he's refused to turn it over to me. I'm hoping that if someone else were to ask, he might be more inclined to relinquish it. What do you say? He's held a grudge against me for years. It's petty, really. I'm sure he thinks that doing this now will hold back my career. He wouldn't listen when I tried to explain this isn't about me. There are bigger concerns. Oh, thank you. At last I knew he was on a field assignment somewhere near the outskirts of the city. Uh, perhaps it's best if you don't mention my name in the process. Okay. On the outskirts of the city. All right. I don't know how far that will be, but hey. Over here, okay. Could you stand a little to the left? I think you're blocking my readings. Trees? Uh, I see what's going on here. You're working with Kelton, aren't you? Nice try, but it's not happening. No, no way. Kelton is actively ruining my career. There's no chance that I'm helping him with anything. Whatever this thing is he's on about, He's just doing it to make himself look good with the higher-ups. I'm not helping him with that. <laughs> right. Of course, we're all in danger. Trees are involved, after all. Uh, he really won't let this go, will he? Hmm. Maybe I can make this work in my favor. Okay, you know what? I'll hand over the data. But I'm only going to do so after you've helped me secure a better position in MAST. Oh, don't worry. You're just going to erase some files for me. Make sure I look good next time promotions get passed around. Well, then I guess we don't have anything else to discuss. And Kelton can just forget about getting his hands on the data. See you around. Okay, so we have to do it then. Okay. Changed your mind, did you? Willing to help me get a promotion? Wait, really? Wow. Okay. Okay. I've gotten a few bad performance evaluations in the last couple of years. Totally unjustified. Incredibly unfair. I found a backdoor into the mass network so I could make some changes to my personnel file. But it turns out the chief engineer knows what she's doing. The only way to get access is from the terminal in her apartment, which is kind of... locked. Hmm... <laughs> Sorry, that's not on the table. Advancing my career is the right thing to do, so that's what I'm focused on. From where I'm standing. Kelton already made this personal, you know. I'm just fixing it. Enough. The deal is the deal. You just get in, access her terminal, delete the files, and get out. Really simple. Okay. We failed, but that's no big deal. <clears throat> oh, don't.
Don't worry about it. It's just, uh, pretty much everything in my personnel file. Most of it is fine, of course. I'm good at what I do. I just received a few very unfair reviews recently, and I figure... Why not start over completely? Well then, you totally understand where I'm coming from. Sometimes you just have to take matters into your own hands. Or, I guess, force them into the hands of someone who needs something from you. Best of luck out there. Alright, I am going to put a save. I could save scum that, but when it comes to something like that, I don't think I'm going to. And plus, we more than likely would have failed again anyway. Because we don't have any points in persuasion yet at all. So yeah, there's that. But anyways, I want to put a cut in the video here. And if you guys enjoyed this video, feel free to subscribe, like, and hit the bell. It will help my channel grow. And yeah, I will see all of you next time with some more Starfield. Have a wonderful day.